Welcome to the demonstration of CloudExtend Outlook for NetSuite, which helps provide 360-degree visibility to important emails, events, and documents. The most important use case is attaching an email to NetSuite so it can be available to others in your organization. Using CloudExtend, I can attach this email and the signed file directly to any of 14 different NetSuite record types. Here, I will use the Auto Suggest button, and CloudExtend has identified the contact and the opportunity. Since the email is relevant to the opportunity, I'm going to add it there. I'm also going to include the signed contract as well by enabling attachments and checking off the attachment below. Next, I'll just click Attach, and CloudExtend will attach the email and file to the opportunity record. Here is the email on the opportunity record, and here is the file that was uploaded. I can even click the file and view it. I can also navigate to the parent customer record and see the same email and file there, which really gives me a 360-degree view of important communications in NetSuite. CloudExtend also allows users to create and edit certain NetSuite records. Once I click on the name, I can click the little pencil next to contact details, and I could edit this information. So I'm going to change the phone number, and I'm going to change Jess Kanana's title. Once I hit update, that new information will now be updated on Jessica's contact record in NetSuite. Next, I want to quickly add the new contact to NetSuite for Adriana Avery, my new point of contact. CloudExtend will suggest a name, add the email, and even allow me to associate the contact with the company so they're not orphaned in NetSuite. Once I hit Save, this newly created contact will now be in NetSuite. CloudExtend also allows users to attach calendar events from Outlook to up to 14 different NetSuite record types. Since my recipient is the primary contact on the opportunity, they came back in the auto-suggest. I'll go ahead and save this event to the NetSuite opportunity. Once saved, I can then send the event as well. Most important, it's associated with the opportunity. And just like email, it rolls up to the parent record as well, giving that full 360 visibility into all customer communications. Giving your colleagues a 360-degree view of important customer activity is easy with CloudExtend and NetSuite. Here I'm using a NetSuite customer dashboard, and I've added the timeline portlet to it. This is extremely useful to me because I can easily and quickly see and filter on the most recent activities with the customer. Here you can see Outlook open on a cell phone. I can invoke Cloud Extend by tapping the menu icon and selecting Cloud Extend. Here you can see the same contextual search based on sender and recipients. I'll go ahead and attach this email to Opportunity 60. It's as easy as that. I've created a SharePoint folder called Socially Savvy Studio. I want to store all my files related to Socially Savvy Studio here. I'll have some pretty large files, and the cost of storing them in SharePoint is minimal. I also want these files to be available to me directly from the Socially Savvy Studio record in NetSuite. Let's see how that can be done. I'm logged into my Microsoft 365 account and have opened the Cloud Extend Files tab on the Socially Savvy Studio customer record. From there, I want to associate that Socially Savvy Studio SharePoint folder. I can do that by selecting Attach from OneDrive right here, and then navigating to the SharePoint library and choosing the folder that I would like to attach. I'm going to click on the Socially Savvy Studio folder here, and then click Open. Now the entire folder will be associated with the NetSuite record. Now I can add any files and folders I want to the Socially Savvy Studio folder in SharePoint. Now that these files are in SharePoint, I have direct access to them in NetSuite. All of the permissions are respected as well. I can also add files to SharePoint from NetSuite by clicking on the Upload icon. I can drag and drop one or more files right here on the target and then select the folder I want them in. Once I close the window, the files will then be uploaded to SharePoint and available to me directly in NetSuite as well. Last, I want to show how you can save attachments directly from your email to SharePoint and see them in NetSuite without taking up any storage space. From here, I want to save this large recording of a training session for a customer directly to that NetSuite record. Since I've already associated that folder with the customer record, all I've got to do is click Save As on the attachment, find the SharePoint folder, and then click Save. Now that will be saved directly to that NetSuite record for Socially Savvy Studio. Thank you for watching this demonstration. If you have any questions, please contact your account executive.